Hey, what up, Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're doing good. Welcome to my AC Valhalla Let's Plays on Very Hard Difficulty Master Assassin and Pathfinder. So, in today's episode, we're still continuing to do the Abbot's Gambit. Man, it's taking time, huh? Well, while we're exploring all other regions, I decided to include everything. Uh, so, the plan is we are gonna go through this location here, pick all of that thing up. And then finally move to the area and pick all, all of this up before we proceed anywhere else. So, uh, let's move out, ladies and gents. And uh, there's our tower that we need to go to. <laughs> Come here, wolf. Let's go. Yeah! We got a scroll, some mysterious, mysterious mist, mystery. Dover, the emissary is somewhere here. Perhaps I can find the letter without bloodshed. Bard said paladins trained at this fortress. This will not be an easy fight. Oh, so this place is part of the quest, or what? Then I must be able to shoot it. There we go. Dead. Stop clucking like a laying hen. I'm the one with a broken leg. Hello. Someone is stuck. My brother. Chasing some foolish legend that if you see old Hisser from above and catch his tail, he will grant you a wish. And what of your leg? Likely sprained, trying to climb up to rescue him. <laughs> we are a sorry pair. Okay. I could use just an explosive arrow to break this thing. But I'm gonna... Stop shoot the thing like on top. Hen. I'm the one with the broken leg. At least grab old Hisser's tail while you're up there. Something is hissing. Someone got their strength. Are there snakes up here too? All right, all right. Ah! Ah! I hate snakes. Can you see a haystack or something? I'm not afraid of them. Are you mad? From this height? That's I have a friend dead. who's terrified of snakes. No, my fate is sealed. I was just waiting. I'll help you down, but how is a big, strong nose like yourself afraid of heights? And snakes! <laughs> I don't know how I let my brother talk me into these schemes. I think I just give in to his endless goading, but I'm sick to the back teeth of him. Climb up on it, go in that cave of wolves on it, <laughs> eat that red mushroom. Siblings are a source of great joy and equal misery. I too have a brother. Does yours put you in the maw of death every opportunity he gets? Come, let's get you down. And perhaps you can tell him how you feel. Talk of my feelings to my brother. I would rather let the snakes gnaw on my tender parts. This way. It's too high to get down from here. There, the ladder. Watch your step. Kinda dead. This way. I'll take it an easier way. This way. <laughs> there.
Or did I have to help him to get down? He can't get down by himself, man. Come on. What the hell? Ah, because of the snake. I'm alive! Brother! Thank you, stranger, for bringing this waste of breath back to me. You're welcome. But what is the story you spoke of? Old Hissa. A pretty legend. He who catches old Hissa's tail will find her heart's wish granted. I found such a story in a manuscript. Up in the tower. Then may it bring you more luck than it did us. Maybe you will even solve the serpent's mystery. Farewell. May Odin litter your path with riches. Goodbye. And keep each other safe. For a good brother is the truest treasure from the gods. I'll see you, big lump. All that. All right, and we're done. Finally, move to the quest. See that shot? That was a good shot. Some leather for Daddy Z. Oh, where'd it go? Uh, okay. So then, guide me. I should be cautious around here. That was loud. If I could steal the letter without killing the emissary, it would keep me out of trouble. Joseph Elderman is a thane called Tetmund. The abbot Cunebert will want to know. Hooray! Now I think I can kill whoever I want to kill. Right? Since it's completed. Hello. <laughs> What? He blocked it? I didn't see that arrow. Oh, he dodged. <laughs> oh man, look at that. He is angry. But why the, he always closes his eyes? I, I don't get it. 
He always freaking closes his eyes whenever he's doing like a, a finish move or something. <laughs> oh man, I'm so bored. This game is so easy. <laughs> Put that on my thumbnail. <laughs> boring, boring. You're boring. Ah. Come on, make your move. This game is so boring, not hard. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh man. Some treasures around here. Let's pick up those small ones first. I should meet Bassam and the Abbot in Falkenstern. <laughs> Yeah, they need to make it a little bit more challenging. How was that? But the game is good, I love it. But if they will make it a little bit more challenging, I'll love it even more. Professional. Bam, bam, bam. <laughs> ha, he did not see me. I have no idea. Must be blocked from the other side. Ugh, cockroach. Ah, oh, yeah. Got <laughs> Just smash the window. <laughs> okay, this must have some more gold. Together, lad! <laughs> 
Time to fight. That's a good shot. Oh, look at that. Right into the cheek. <laughs> right into the cheek with the cheeky cheek. And they did not see me. Man. Please make this game a little bit harder. Just a little bit. <laughs> I'm sure there's no more. Mm -hmm. I think that other armor is in the underground. Gotta go to th through the skill book. <laughs> do you see those ladders over there? What we gotta do, man. Locked. And who's got the damn key? Jump up feet. <laughs> Am I gonna make it? Oh yes I have. <laughs> Slumber. What is that? I barely use these abilities to be honest. An hour mark when some will put the targets to sleep and most instantly. On the impact iron spells. Oh, okay. <sighs> Almost fell asleep. So we got one more little treasure here somewhere. Where are you, treasure? <laughs> Where's the treasure? Probably in the underground.
mean, oops. That was some good moving, Kingsman. Whoa! Whoa! Did you see that? The guy tricked me. <laughs> he jumped on his back. Jump around. Give up! <laughs> but man, that was a good trick. I think that's their special combo. Ah. Man, these hammers are just low. Told you it's on the ground. Pretty fun. No man. <laughs> Yo. Oh shit. <laughs> I thought I could have stopped it. Survived. Good job, man. Good job. Strip the dog up.
Got it all. Uh, let's go quickly do those three as well. Uh, change of plan. I'll do that some other time. <sighs> Shaka laka rocka maka phone. Let me see if ESO servers are back up. Hey, they're back up. <laughs> Time to play some ESO. I have news. Kent's new elderman will be Thane Tedmund. Tedmund? Oh, the Lord is testing me. He is made mouse by you Danes. Barely leaves his fortress at Rue Sister. How might I gain his influence if he will not speak to me? Or to anyone? It is a puzzle. <laughs> to inspire loyalty, Tedmund must owe you something. Such as his life. Go on. A fortress stormed, Sneaky a man rush. kidnapped. If you beat back his enemy, saved him from sure death, his gratitude would... Swell. It would know no bounds. But that fortress will be harder to pry open than a nun's knees. Perhaps. Perhaps not. Are you hiding something, Bassin? There is a lumber mill nearby, correct? Bemisfield. Alfred invests much in fortifying Wessex, and uses our forests to do so. The mill provides his wood. Tedmund is there. Impossible! How do you know? I heard rumors that Tedmund had been lured out of self-exile, to manage work on the fortifications of Canterbury. Taking him from a lumber yard is less dangerous than assaulting a fortress. But your rescue attempt will not have the same flair. Is it worth it? It may still work. Yes. Yes. Bring him to the Megaliths. And Fulke? When I have Tebman's fealty, you shall have Fulke. Now go. I will rustle up a small rescue party. Hot pits and prisoners. So, Basin, why aren't you talking, man? I'm wary of this Abbot Basin. He is self serving and evasive. Can he really deliver Fulke? The Abbot is a friend of Fulke's. That is clear. So long as he doesn't suspect our motive. We <laughs> They're <chance>. attacking Basin. <laughs> this brings to mind they a don't story. like him. Perhaps what do you do, Basil? The scorpion and the frog. A children's story? It's a cautionary tale. The scorpion wants to cross the river, but he cannot swim. So he enlists the help of the frog. The frog agrees to carry him on his back, extracting a promise that I the scorpion will not sting him. Let me guess. The scorpion reneges, blaming his nature, and both drown. <laughs> the scorpion crosses the river and stings an innocent man, killing him. So what does this tale tell us? That your stories are clouded and their meaning doubly so? It shows that every tale has a thousand possible outcomes. Many of which are surprising. If the abbot does not deliver Fulke, he will die at my hand. And we will continue our search. A sobering approach. Bassin, what you do, man? What you insult? Venus field is just ahead. Lead. I will follow. Oh, 
А, тихо, короче. This chase will catch us a plum head. Level up. Once the abbot has Tedman's gratitude, he will deliver Folke. It will cost us nothing more than this. If that leaden wit keeps his word. Alright, but this we're gonna continue in the next episode. So I hope you enjoyed the show, and if you did, you know the drill. Don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody see them, nobody can read them, nobody can respond to them. So if you got something to say, feel free to comment. Just don't swear, as simple as that. If you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Z Clan. I'm Gamer Z Soul from Ukraine. So hi from Ukraine, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.